is only about 60 pounds he's trying to lift. This is where you need that extra 35 pounds of pure beef. Right near that cloud. Yeah, that looks good. There's a lot of clouds. No, it's that cloud there. The little tiny one with next to the big one. What we need to do is a number of things. We're going to pre-feed and make sure you lock it. We're going to pre-feed and make sure we lock it. Then, I guess the two of us, who's on the spin halyard? Oh, as soon as you lock that, you've got to go to the spin halyard on a, on a winch. That's good. Two more feet. Go left just a hair, go left just a hair. And let's see if we can get the screecher in. Fall off. Down, 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 down. Bring it all the way in. Now up, 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 up. Right there, right there. There you go. Took us a while. Actually, I'm really thinking that we probably should have been down another two feet. Well, that's that strained out that edge a yeah, pretty good, eh? A little bit. What do you think? Talk to us. You're the trimmer. I don't. No, I don't think it changed much yet. Oh, bull don't talk to us again. It straightens it out if you get the wind to fill it perfectly. <laughs> How far do you say we're out? Well, we've been uh, 45 minutes at 7 knots. I'd say we're 8 knots for 5, 6 miles. Where we fed the, the sheet is working well. Yes. I don't that's think you really want it anywhere else. No, that's exactly where it had to be. It's got a good lead to the winch and it's far aft and yep. outboard. And yep. 9 2. 9. We had 10 upwind, right? Yeah. We, we, and then we got hit by a wave, then we're down on day one. Yeah. That'll happen. This does not feel like nine. The boat's really It's eight. eight. Now you're a connoisseur of nine. <laughs> Among other things. This feels nine. This is nothing. We've been out here at 17, 18. Yeah. You know, we're a wake but. That was buried. Well, there was spray coming off that you yeah. wouldn't believe. Well, nine five. Building. Ten one. Yeah. We caught that wave. I would like to get some water. You would. So you want you want someone to trim for you? Yeah, probably. You want to grab this for a sec? Or? I want to get food. Oh wait. I think we're moving better than we were. Wait. How many how many people can break at the same time here? Just two. Two. Only two people. Well, we're on break. Oh, so you two are on break. Yeah, Keith and I are breaking right now. We're on break. We're on break? Yeah, we're on break. Yeah, absolutely. They got to break. Our break goes until the sun uh, sets. You can feel the dagger board like vibrate. Vibrate, yes. Hear it? Yes. It. Yes. But you can you can tell when it's getting right now it's doing 10 8 to, to 11 when it comes in 
that's 11 5 11 8 11 7 so right into the 11 so it sort of tells you what speed you're doing much help? Is there much weather help? No. Not it's at all. Nicely yes. I think that was the trimmer's job. I think they trimmed it up quite well. Um, yeah, everybody's fine. You guys never had a boat at home, huh? No, I have. Well, it is on the other side. I got an Opti at home. The Opti Hums? Yeah. At what speed? I don't know. <laughs> I just I was sailing and I just heard a boat. I'm like... I feel a little, a little gust. What are we doing now? Oh, I feel that gust. A little bit down, a little bit down. There you go. Okay, okay. Well, he's not hungry anymore all of a sudden. <laughs> Alright, well, I agree with you, Vic. We're probably 10 miles out. Yeah, no. 13.5! Uh, Not a sail you want to do in 20 knots. This is a heavy duty sail. Yeah. 